Hi friends, good morning. Please look at the next problem in compound interest. Friends, problem is given in the description box. See friends, P1 into 1 plus R by 100. This is the installment paid at the end of the first year. And P2 into 1 plus R by 100 into 1 plus R by 100. This is the installment paid at the end of the second year. Where P1 is the present worth of the installment paid at the end of the first year. Whereas P2 is the present worth of the installment paid at the end of the second year. Friends, these two installments are equal. Equal annual installments. So, this and this cancel. So, now P1 is to P2. P1 is to P2 is equal to 1 plus R by 100. Friends, 1 plus R by 100. 1 plus 40 by 100. 140 by 100. 27 is 25. So, 1 plus R by 100 is equal to 7 by 5. Friends, P1 is to P2 is equal to 7 by 5. And we know P1 plus P2 is equal to 1500. The sum of the present ones, the sum of the present ones, that is the total amount to due, is 1500. So, now let us find P1. Let us divide 1500 in the ratio 7 is to 5 to get P1 and P2. So, 1500 into 7 by 12, we get P1. 12 12s, 144, 12 5s. So, 800, 725, 125, 175. So, P1 is equal to 875, friends. Now, the installment value, either P1 into 1 plus R by 100 or P2 into 1 plus R by 100 whole square. So, now let us take this one. P1 into 1 plus R by 100 is the installment value. So, P1 into 1 plus R by 100. 517 is 85, 5 5 is 35. 770 is 119 plus 3, 122 friends. 1225 is the equal annual installment friends. Thank you.